Welcome to Unfinished Creations. This video is for all painting lovers out there where I am going to share my favorite landscape painting but with a little twist in it. If you have seen my other videos, you must be knowing how much I love my DIYs. So in this video, I am going to share an easy freehand sunset landscape painting on a canvas tote bag. So let's start painting. Let's start by placing a cardstock paper like this to protect the other side of the bag. Now dip the sponge in water and apply it to the bag to make the bag slightly wet. Do this till half length of the bag and rest we will do later. Take bright yellow color first for creating the sunset effect and start painting the bag from upper side. Due to the damp surface, it's easy to spread the color faster and also it helps to get the watery effect in the paint. If needed, you can always add water in the brush in between. Now we are almost done with the yellow color. Clean the brush and dip it in water to make the yellow border and lower area little more wet so that our orange color will blend in with yellow one very nicely. Take orange color and start painting it below the yellow one. You can always use water in between to spread and blend the colors whenever needed. It's a freehand painting. Nothing could go wrong with this. Make thin orange lines and then blend it nicely to give the sun rays effect. Now we are done with orange as well, so let's apply water till this arrow to make the sky darker with red shade. Blend red color with orange like we did for orange and yellow. Fill the remaining uncolored area with black color. Don't apply water on this area as we need our black color to be nicely opaque. Fill this black color while the red one is still wet to create tiny lines between them forming grass on the landscape. Now keep this aside until it's completely dry. Once the back has dried completely, take two different sizes of flat brushes to paint trees on it. I am trying to make coconut trees here, so with the help of bigger size brush, we will make the stem first. Now we will make outline for leaves with the help of smaller size flat brush. For making coconut tree leaves, take black color on a flat brush and wipe off the extra color from the brush and then try to make thin leaves of the tree like this. While making these leaves, just make sure you have not taken too much of color on the brush. And just go on with the free hand. Landscape painting are my most favorite. Let me know in the comment below what kind of painting are your favorite and together we can spread the joy of being creative.
with the same flat brush make the middle thick line of the leaf do the same thing with all the leaf outlines it seems to be hard at once but trust me just grab your creative spirits and go on now we are almost done with the trees so let's make some other objects on our sunset landscape like flying birds here you can definitely use permanent marker instead of brush if you are not comfortable with it Let's paint a small house beside the trees. For this, first make a square kind of object with black color. Then make two curvy lines crossing each other at the top to make the roof of the house. As this is a sunset landscape, so let's make the rising moon as well. With a very small size brush and white color, paint more than a half size moon to give the rising effect. I have retouched the grasses with black color to make them bold. Now we are done painting our bag and this is how it looks at the end. Pretty good. I hope you like this DIY come painting video. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it and please subscribe so that you don't miss any of the upcoming videos. I'll see you soon. Bye. Love being creative.